been here before? I definitely have and that's why in this video I'm going to show you guys a cute quick and easy hairstyle that you can do when you don't have a lot of time to get ready. So let's go. First as you guys can see my hair has been blown out. I gave myself a trim so this is what my hair is looking like. But the good thing about this hairstyle is if your hair is in its natural state or you just did a wash and go or something like that this hairstyle will still work as well. So I just sectioned off two sections in the front as you guys can see. We're going to come back to this a little bit later. So the first product that I'm going to be using is the Moisture RX Styling Gel. And I'm using this because it has a lot of slip. And as you guys can see, I have a lot of hair. And so this is going to help me to get all of this thick hair up into a nice ponytail. So I'm just taking my bristle brush to help smooth out everything. This is a water-based gel, so it does curl your hair up a little bit. It will revert your hair a little bit if you start off with blow-dried hair. So that's definitely something that you want to keep in mind if you decide to use this gel. So after I get my ponytail together, next I'm going to go in with the rice water braid gel. So obviously you can use this for braids, but I'm gonna use this to kind of reinforce my ponytail. I'm gonna get rid of any flyaways because the product just has a lot of hold and I like to use it on the nape of my neck. And like I said, just to smooth out the hair and get rid of any flyaways that I may have. So once I get my ponytail together, then I'm gonna work with this section at the top. And what I'm gonna be doing is creating a top knot. So I'm just splitting the section in half. Then with each section, I'm just gonna two strand twist it, and then I'm just gonna pin it down, and I'm just gonna work on creating that top knot. So once your top knot is created, you can stretch it, you can pull it, and you can just um, form it to however you want it to look. So now that I'm done with the top knot, I'm gonna go back to these two sections in the front here, and I'm gonna be using the Moisture RX Hair Butter to braid these two sections down. So all I'm gonna be doing are some plaits basically, and I'm basically creating some braided tendrils in the front just to give our top knot a little something extra than, you know, just having all the hair pulled back and having the top knot that way. I decided I wanted to do something a little bit different. So again, I'm going to go back in with the braid gel and this time I'm going to be using it on my edges. I want to show you guys the consistency of this product. Even though this is a braid gel, the consistency is more like a edge control, which I think is perfect for edges. So that's why I decided to use it on my edges and I like it. It has a good amount of hold. I'm able to kind of mold my edges however I want. So I absolutely love that about this product. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just tie my hair up, let my hair set so everything can just stay in place. So this would be the time that you would go pick your clothes out. You would go do your makeup because you wanna make it to this event on time, okay? So now that my hair has set for about 10 to 15 minutes, this is what it's looking like. As you guys can see, your girl is really feeling herself in this hairstyle. So just to jazz up the hairstyle a little bit more, I decided to add some gold accessories because I'm extra. So I had to make this look a little bit extra. You know, if you were going out somewhere, you know, this would be perfect for that. Just so you can look like you tried and it didn't take you five minutes to do your hair. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give the video a thumbs up and I'm going to catch y'all in my next video. Bye.